with this one putt, Dallas Baptist locked up the national championship. I just felt so much joy. It's surreal. I mean, it really is. I woke up this morning and just kind of laid there and was like, I'm a national champion. And this championship for DBU, the first in any sport in school history, was more than a year in the making. When COVID hit, we were number one in the country. You're kind of in shock because you know you're gelling, you're playing really well, and, and then it's taken away from you. Hannah Harrison and Evelyn Arwella saw their senior year evaporate before their eyes. Fortunately, the NCAA allowed them and other seniors to come back for one more year. My story wasn't over. Our, my time with these girls and with Coach wasn't over, and I didn't want me and Evelyn's story to be ended because of COVID, and I wanted it to be on our terms. And it was, but not before DBU had to make a major comeback on Saturday against Lynn University. I can, there's probably so many people at home thought that we were done. Team number one, Faith De La Garza, led by just a stroke. Olivia Mitchell trailed her match by two, and Hannah trailed by three with seven holes to play. I really didn't have any doubts, honestly. I knew we're going to find a way to get there because we've worked so hard for it. I told myself all day, I was like, you are not going to lose your last college career match. She didn't. Hannah came back to win her match by a stroke. Faith rode a birdie streak to a seven-stroke win. And capping off her own comeback, Olivia Mitchell finished off a championship. I wish anybody could feel it. It was like a roller coaster up and down, but I'm glad that we landed at the top. In Dallas, I'm Mike Leslie.